Right. Bro, there, there is no qu <laughs> question. I'd rather have my knees not bent. <laughs> oh, I'd rather have my arms. Bro, you are not thinking, <laughs> you're not about thinking this. it through. You're not, you're not thinking, thinking it through. through man. You're just going like, I want to run. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be nice. But but no, it, but it, it is you're running like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Running like this, <laughs> and then and then you're sweating, but you can't wipe your own forehead. <laughs> <laughs> you ever met this guy? Oh, I'm the dumb one. You can't argue. There's something about me. You have no idea what you're saying. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. So, you, you, you so Eric, you had the one of the cops on who actually no, I, I did George Lopez's podcast and oh, and he, he had him on. Yeah, he they no, they do a podcast together. Oh, oh, damn. Yeah, they do a podcast it's together. A, it's a what, what are they like? I don't what, even know. This guy talk about after you're done talking about the Night Stalker. Yeah, he just I, I was <laughs> yeah. so fascinated. I just kept asking him questions about what is like the, yeah, but so every episode's about the Night Stalker. No, a it's bit? just about like uh, no, a true just, crime and that kind of. It thing. is yeah. George Lopez does. Yeah. yeah oh, that's hilarious. About, but it just gets in a bunch uh, of most stuff. Most handsome serial killer of all time. I don't know, man. It, especially when no, he has teeth. When think, he got his uh, teeth fixed. Yeah. I think, I think Jeffrey Dahmer Ted, got him beat. No, you're going to say Ted Bundy. No, no, no. Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy is the one. Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeffrey Dahmer. Terrible. Yeah. I, 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 honestly, I, Ted Bundy. I, I think Ed Gaines was really attractive. Yeah. Big guy. All right. Fuck, Mary kill. Don't ask them. Here's the thing. <laughs> I would like to ask him if it was. Yeah, yeah. Kill, kill, Here's the thing about the Night Stalker, though. Uh, you know, this is in the 70s, and he would creep through the windows. And at the time, the police stations didn't talk, so they couldn't figure out that he was killing all these people in different areas. But he, you couldn't have the Night Stalker in 2022 because everyone has air conditioning now. Nobody leaves their windows open. Mm. He ain't creeping through my door. Well, with not that, everybody. With that ring security. Who's that on the left? Ed Gein. That is him? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh. I'm not scared. Is that Elmer Fudd? Is that Brian Elmer... Callen? <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. Elmer Fudd. And the guy on the right, uh, the Night Stalker, looks like Theo. Wow, Theo and Brian Callen right there. Let's <laughs> do on Brian. Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, it feels yeah. like and if long the guy lost, had glasses if... in the back, that'd be me, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, that's Theo's kid if he had a baby in the with background. That Indian girl. Remember he's gonna have a oh, baby yeah, with that yeah, Indian yeah, girl? Yeah, 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 yeah. You you uh you attractive or what, you think? Am I attracted? Yeah. To, am I attracted to the nope, Night Nope, you're attractive, what? right? You got a good shirt on and you got a fucking, your forehead's nice too, dude. Oh, you like the four? Nah, you're just an attractive guy, dude. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> uh, I, I'm an LA6. Nah, dude, you're not. You're you're more than that. And it's it's annoying, frankly. <laughs> <laughs> you, your forehead and it it like slopes down in like a nice way and like you you got brows and they're pronounced and it's just, you, go fuck yourself, man. <laughs> You know, I'm the caveman. Picture I sent him it's from good that though. It works for Pro you, Magnum. dude. It you works for you. Picture I sent from uh, that of that one of that looks like him. Uh, is it? It was is that it Tom team? Hardy. Oh yeah. No, it was like this movie. Somebody sent it to me. Oh yeah, I saw that. It's Guys, I'm stressed out, man. I'm gonna be in fucking Dallas. What the fuck? <laughs> like, Got to go to crystalia.com for tickets. Jesus Christ, just been weighing on me. Oh, I got the <laughs> dopest freaking hat for you for Dallas. You don't wear is it a cowboy though? hat? Uh, it, I mean, I have a cowboy if you want. There you are right there. That's pretty That damn. is Spot you, on. bro. That is you. <laughs> what movie is it? I mean, I, I don't I don't view myself. That is honestly, dude, you honestly, bro. Me? You don't see honestly, you in that? Bro, honestly. Are you kidding me? You, 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 for real, being real, you dress like that. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you you have a hat like that. Depend, oh, yeah. I got another one coming, too, from Daisy May. With an oversized Dude, jacket. What fuck? What is this hat that you're going to get from Daisy May? And what is Daisy May? Daisy May. He makes custom hats like those. Daisy is da his name? No. Uh, oh, it's just a yeah, brand. Okay. That's his brand, okay. Daisy May. So he makes hats for, like, ZZ Top. He just made a, a collab with uh, Post Malone. Like he's oh, okay. Up. Cool, cool. Yeah. Cool. He's dope. Really so dope. does he go to crystalia.com to get tickets to Dallas or no? Whoever, right? Dude, anyone, you know anyone. Told me? I get he was it. Like, okay. He was like, oh, I'm trying to figure out how to get tickets uh, in Dallas, crystalia. Mm. He's like, but I'm so annoyed because I got to be in Baltimore, August 4th through the 6th oh. at your shows oh, that in Baltimore next week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I'm in Baltimore. Oh. And then he goes, and then what's crazy about that yeah. is- Is that Wichita, crystalia.com? You got to go to Wichita? No. Oh, what? No, no. He didn't say that. What then he goes, he dude, I'll be in Chicago, August 26th, one mm. night only at the Den Theater, because you're there. I went, oh, I do. okay, okay. And then cool. I told him, I said, get tickets at thickboy.com. Yeah. So he didn't say anything about Atlanta or DC, crystalia.com. He, he did. go to Atlanta. He oh, did. September 9th and 10th. Okay, cool. So anyway. Oh, wow. <laughs> there it is, dude. <laughs> That's you. Wow. That's wow. like you dressed up as that guy for Halloween. <laughs> Unbelievable. His nose is better, though, yeah. Uh, well, 
you know, who is that guy, honestly? And I'll be at La Jolla. Wow. <laughs> oh, so sad. So, so sad. No energy. September 9th to so, the 11th. Uh, no right. energy. <laughs> so no sad. energy. Well, I had to look and I know, see. Dude. I was like, do I have something coming up? Yeah, wow. I do. La I was, Jolla, dude, I was in San Diego store. during Comic-Con. Oh, yeah. How uh, was it? Dude, it was lit. You've been there. That's the reason I did the club, because I featured for you there. Yeah, yeah. Great club, Laugh Factory San Diego. But, dude, Comic-Con, I thought it was like, kids like teenagers oh bro bro there's people like eric dressed up as yeah, fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. popeye there's people Hulk. dressed up as eric yeah, yeah. bro 100%. it's 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 fucking <laughs> we saw seven they say smoothies <sighs> dude yeah. it is an insane thing i went to comic-con when i was in eighth grade and it was just one room bro it was just one room with a like a few booths and like i would get the guy's signatures and bro it is unbelievable now man yeah back then it would be like those kind of dudes that walk on hollywood boulevard yeah, yeah, yeah. dressed as spider-man with a fanny pack. yeah <laughs> uh, now, yeah now you know what i mean bro now like hot chicks dressed up and <laughs> yeah, shit yeah, yeah, no yeah. way dude back then no yeah. way no yeah. now dude. it's like movie quality outfits well like they, i thought they, 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 announced, they announce movies there now yeah. and all the stars come like, and like they, marvel pays up the gazoo yeah. like they had chris pratt there yeah. I think they had all the big yeah. ones there but they had uh yeah when, when they had uh what's his name uh who's the guy from breaking bad uh the, the main guy uh brian cranston. brian cranston they had brian cranston dressed as brian cranston remember he had the mil the do you, do you hear I about remember. this he had the mask on and he was walking around like the breaking bad guy oh, wow. and then he was uh, he walked up on the podium and he took it off and it was really him and everyone was like what it was you <laughs> funny <laughs> i i didn't realize how big it was it was chaos yeah, it was, it was really big. Chaos. It, it, it's crazy bro it's crazy yeah this part right people here realized too they were bumping incredibly realistic heisenberg mask that people realized too they were bumping into he said he walked the floor in the mask trying to use a higher voice pretending to be a fan isn't that he funny added, so it was fun <laughs> meeting you and you met me yep and that's how the isn't that funny i've never seen that show you know what i do if he's like oh it's really me i go very cool, dude. Oh, wow. I keep going. You've never you seen, seen Breaking, Breaking Bad? Bad? Nah, I have no desire. You, you know, know when I, I watched it? Over the uh, pandemic. Oh, and you loved it? God. It's, it's the best show it's ever been. Yeah. You're crazy. It is. Yeah. It is. But like, you know what? I feel this energy though because sometimes I was two years late on it because when people start talking I about something, I just watched it. I know, but when people yeah. start talking about something, no, you go, I, yeah. I'm out. Okay. Oh, oh, that's 100%. Yeah. 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 Uh, like, I still haven't watched uh, Mad Men. I think that's a comedian thing because you are like, I'm not gonna be a part of whatever anyone else is yeah, doing. Yeah, yeah. You know everyone's what I mean? going that way. I <laughs> yeah. go this way. Yeah, yeah. I, dude, no, I, I do got, that too. I was six years late on Game of Thrones. I oh, made yeah. fun of dragons yeah. for yeah. years. Yeah, and yeah. Now that's Game my of favorite show of all time. I watched it. I watched. I, I I I watched three seasons. I, I I think I might even watch four. And I was like, when does it? I, I'm 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 when not a Game of what? Thrones guy. When does it what? Yeah, when does it get good? God, you're the worst. Wow, you're the. But you like Breaking Bad. Yeah, it's great. It's the best show. Here's of all my time. thing with Breaking Bad. I went, Hold on. So uh, he's gonna sell uh, whatever meth. Cook meth. His teacher wife has cancer. All right, got it. Nah, oh my you're God. a fucking I went like this. What? <laughs> That's the dumbest right, thing that has I ever been like said. This. On this Are you kidding me? I went like this. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. That is so I'm crazy. Busy. Talk about an over <laughs> oversimplification. Yeah. Check, please. Dude, the acting when he. I'm not gonna spoil it, but no, when, please. Do. No, I'm not going to spoil it. No, spoil, but when he's spoil. on the phone at the, it's like one of the last episodes talking to his wife yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and saying, yeah, was saying <laughs> the thing about how like you had nothing to do with it and you know you did. And he's, bro, he I finally go, admitted like who oh, you like. Oh, there's a different level of acting. Yeah. He go, I go, oh. I'll oh, quit Hollywood. Oh, Mr. Acting's Easy. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. Remember Mr. No, no, Acting's Easy? No, 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 no. But, but most Certain of it. Acting. No, no, most yeah. of it. I'm with him on that. Most of it. Yeah. You, you, his part, you can't play that part. I mean, nobody can play that part. Christian Bale, him. Bring up my scene from I'm Dying Up Here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Eric, I, I Christian that Bale, show. that guy, and Eric Griffin. Christian Bale, <laughs> dude, I know you're not going to see this movie. I know he's so great. People say he's so great in Thor. He is so good in Thor. I'll see that movie. <laughs> my brother, you know what, though? I won't. The, here's, I won't. here's two villains. The dude that was in Wonder Woman 2, the, that guy that plays the villain in Wonder Woman 2, he shouldn't have been in the movie because he was so good. Like, he was bringing stuff to this where he's like, yo, dude, this is Wonder Woman. Like, you tone it down. There is That guy's so uh, good. And Christian Bale was that good. On, okay, well, what's you, Wonder you Woman like 2? One, Who's the guy in Wonder Woman 2? Wonder Woman 2? I saw Wonder Woman 1. It was fine. No, no, no. I saw Wonder Woman. But I'm saying the guy that was the villain. I know. I'm just asking. He's what was a your great opinion actor, on man. Wonder Woman 2, though? It was fine. Wonder Woman 1 was one of the worst movies that I've ever seen in my life. Well, oh, then, my God. Wait, 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 wait. Well, then Which one's the 1984 Woman one? That's Wonder Woman 2. Oh, that's the worst movie I've ever seen in my life. 80s Worst movie I've ever seen in my life. But the guy that was the villain. The guy from Narcos? Yeah. 
He was, and what I'm saying is, he was Eric, out of place. Eric, Eric, he dude, was out it, of place. He was so, so bad. He, that guy's a great actor. Yeah, but it Not was he act. was okay in that. Yeah, he was. That, you that movie he was, was just so okay bad because there was nothing around him to support it. Let me tell you something right now, okay? I, I know, know the problem. Let me tell you. I know the problem. Go ahead. No, go but ahead, there was a scene. Right, the scene he was having with his kid. The movie is out of place. The movie The Gray Man is bad. Ryan Gosling is phenomenal in it. I love that's different, bro. Wonder Woman 84 is so bad, so bad. that nobody's good in it. Uh, well, I thought the guy was good. Gray Man is fine. Wonder Woman 84, one of the worst movies I've ever There's seen. There's no 80s music. <laughs> it's insane. <laughs> Take a note from fucking Stranger Things this too. Fucking- we built this city. I don't do duets, but you we know. Built this I'm city sorry. Was, rock was this the roll. last song? Yeah. We built this city. I don't do duets, but we built <laughs> this city on rock, rock and roll. You go high. During the fucking See, but parts. that's when I get out because I can't. In your invisible you. jet, we built this city. <laughs> <laughs> we built it. Whoa, she just. But but I think this is uh, on the toilet of the invisible jet shitting. <laughs> we built this city. Wait wait wait, Eric. This, I, I think this is part of the problem. Can we when, get to this guy's no definition face. No 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 no. <laughs> yeah, this guy is it. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Dude, just, he has no cheek structure. He's, just, got no <laughs> He's got no ears. He's got oh, no ears. He's got no ears. He just gun. goes from forehead. That's to what the chin. thing is. <laughs> When my son draws humans, this is what they look like. There's no ears. But hold up, though. This guy's got... <laughs> he got a this guy, no, he kind of looks like Chin if Chin used moisturizer. Uh, like his skin no, is flawless. This, yeah. All he is is Chin. <laughs> this guy, yeah, he yeah, should yeah, be yeah. a real Chin. Yeah, yeah. Your <laughs> nickname has been taken away. I know. This, this is, is the, the real Chin. I don't have a Chin. This is this is oh, also the real God. life Quagmire from Family Guy. Yeah. Dude, hold on. His Bring ears are from... a little bit further back. His ears are on the back. Like a Doberman Pinscher. Yeah. Dude, dude, you talk shit from walking behind me. Like, I heard that. <laughs> He's gonna go like this. What? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. Hey, hey. Speak into my good ear. <laughs> Speak into my good ear. And they're small too. There he is. There he is. Oh, That's cool. Oh man, like his ears are touching. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Far yeah. back, his ears are touching. <laughs> You're a handsome dude though. Oh yeah. Uh, he, he, and, and way, you know what? I'm so sorry, dude. You're and watching. Some, I apologize, but you are a character. And somehow he's still ha- he's still yeah, got somehow it. Somehow yeah, he's still handsome. He's, he's a good-looking right? dude. Yeah, mm-hmm. he's definitely a good-looking mm-hmm. dude. Fanny pack chain. All right, let's see what's up. Hey, Chris, let's take a little break from just talking about nothing. Cool, because I'm tired of that. Are you tired of that? This sounds more interesting. It is more interesting because you like money, right? Love it. Daddy has bills, and then you're such a big. But how do I UFC make more fan? money though? Easily, do Dude, you know what I'm talking about? My friends at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC, and this Saturday, UFC 277, you can watch the big pay per view event. You can watch the Calvas Fight Command Thick at 7 p.m. Pacific this Saturday, <laughs> and make money watching UFC 277 with DraftKings this Saturday. New customers can bet five dollars on any fighter to win and get one hundred dollars in free bets. Win or lose, want even more action? You can also double your winnings on a same fight parlay. Combine multiple bets like which fighter will win, how long the fight will last, and so much more. Just place your UFC 277 same game parlay. If it hits, you'll win double. Wow. DraftKings is safe, secure, reliable, and best of all, you can deposit, withdraw your money whenever you want. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use promo code KATS. Bet $5 on any UFC 277 fighter to win and get $100 in free bets no matter what. That's code CATS this Saturday at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC. Minimum age and eligibility restrictions apply. See show notes for details. See next page for directions of disclaimer. DraftKings. We are introducing BlueNile.com, the original online jeweler to high-income adults, 100K plus, $100,000 plus, primarily males, 25 plus, looking to get engaged or gift find jewelry to visit the website and convert into a Blue Nile customer. Do you know what Blue Nile does, dude? They celebrate so all my special here. moments, man, by creating custom engagement rings of his or her dreams, gifting a classic and timeless jewelry piece. What about the prices? Dude, you won't find it at any jewelry store, man. We got you covered, man. We got you guys. With you ready to pop the question, you're celebrating a big moment in your life. Find jewelry as unique as she is with modern Convenience of online shopping at BlueNile.com. All right? Looking for fine jewelry but having trouble choosing? Blue Nile has jewelry experts on hand 24-7. 
We got you, man. Make your moment sparkle with jewelry from BlueNow.com. And going on right now is the Blue Now anniversary sale. Save up to 40% on classic fine jewelry pieces and 25% on engagement rings, which I, I bet you wish you knew this a little bit. Ago, yeah, folks. I wish, but oh well. Plus, every order is insured, ships free, arrives in a discreet little package, so it won't give away what's inside, Daddy. Shop stress-free and find your forever piece. Go to BlueNow.com today. BlueNow.com. Enjoy. I King Queen the Steam Crew. This is Jack from LA. His energy is insane. Right now. Let's, Let's go. go. Oh, when he's in that light, I'm scared to, uh, now. Chin. He came to my restaurant. I work out at a EMC. I he know. He's awesome. Oh. Had a blast. Good to meet him. I have a king and a sting for you. Saying hi to random people's babies while I'm walking around. I Every time. I love babies. Every time. We're just kids. And I just want to say hi. But they get nervous sometimes, and the parents, I don't know if they like it or not. What do you think about that? They talking to babies. Do they have COVID or children. allergies? <laughs> Keep sniffing. Walk. Well, was your weird by head the way, structure. So I don't know if it's yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the baby's thinking, where are his ears? Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, sore. This poor guy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's go. He's such a nice guy, too. You're an alpha. I love you. Hell yeah, bro. <laughs> yes! Not, not after he sees this. <laughs> yes, dude. No, dude. In this room? But in this room, Chris? With my mind. With my mind. <laughs> you could kill me. Yeah. But with my mind. With my there's something about him thing. With my my that thing. My your, that. Your energy? Dude, if we were on an island, and you'd be your, getting the it, fucking coconuts, bro. Don't, give, don't forget to. Uh, you'd be mind. getting the coconuts, bro. We built this city. <laughs> we built this city. Yeah. Well, dude, this guy. Don't talk to people's babies. Oh, uh, you can talk to babies. Well, you could but, go, hi. Yeah, I yeah, know. But I like, do every time. Yeah, but okay. But every time. Thing. You know, you're, yes. you're, 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 this guy's walking towards you. It's you, you're, you're, you're your wife, and, you're, and Calvin's like a little kid, you know, and this guy's just walking, and he just stops you in front of you while you're walking, and he just leans into your you know, Oh, like, well, yeah, that's oh, not too I'm much. Like, oh, Is that what he's talking about? Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's so he, too much. He's saying any kid, any baby. Yeah, yeah but you, if you're just walking by, like, oh, cute baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, fine. And I, I just wait with but the if baby. You're just, you know, but if you're just like, oh. Oh, no. <laughs> of course. Oh, no. That would scare me. Imagine. That scares everybody. Oh, 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 oh. Imagine if you did it. Exactly that. Like, hey, weirdo, who are you? Imagine you know? if you did exactly that. Holy fucking shit, yeah, dude. Yeah. Eric would scare everybody. Um, I'm, I have a, I'm adorable. Yeah. 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 No, Look, kids yeah, are you are adorable. Not when you yeah. bark at them like that. Though, um, right? Come on. That's what people do, man. They see yeah, they do, they do, they do. They start, they do, they are, you know, your baby. But if it's a grown man by himself, I'm like, catch a predator. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I mean it depends their energy, dude. If you, yeah, I, I think, I think anything, uh, anything more than oh hi, hey buddy, oh what you got? You got a cool shirt? Anything more than that, you know? But don't touch them. Well, no, definitely don't <laughs> touch them, dude. Yeah, and and don't by touch the way, the by the way, rule number one. First of all, hey, cool shirt to a baby. I'm just saying, like, maybe they got the, like a race car are you on the shirt. Conversations with a, <laughs> oh, a baby. <laughs> like fuck off, man. Hey, cool shirt. Where'd you get it? That's why my son is advanced. <laughs> I talk to him like a motherfucker. <laughs> Whatever the fuck. He's got a race car on his shirt or something. You go, oh, nice. And yeah, go, and then oh, you yeah. move on though. You stick yeah, yeah, too yeah. Long, you don't keep like, in touch with him. Yeah. <laughs> You, yeah, you're not. Can right. I get your email? Can I get yeah, your? Did he yeah. have a cell phone? No, he's mm -hmm. two months old. He's, he's three. What it's the most Asian weird, ever this weird Asian guy day. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is chins. This yeah. <laughs> 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 Guys, this is Chris from the Chicagoland area. I uh, got a debate club for you. So back in the day, Theo used to joke about Chris running his dogs. Oh, yeah. Um, for pictures on Instagram or social media. Wow, that, that fucking um, I used to ago. think he was kidding until Kelvin was born, right? We haven't seen those dogs since. What's his name? It's like <laughs> Sam and Butter or something like that. Yeah. So we haven't seen them on Chris's Instagram page. That's true. So the big club is, was Chris actually renting his dogs <laughs> for social media? You renting them? Um, I got one for you. Big money. Chris D'Elia. One Aww. dog right here. Look at that. Rufio. He's like old, he's like 12. But uh, let me know. Hit me up. Uh, anyways, love what you guys are doing. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. So King your nice sting it. Bring your guy. dogs to work. I should. You know what's funny, bro? Sting it. <laughs> sting what? The dogs to work? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You know what's funny <laughs> is, okay, dogs. so... Dogs so, and kids, by the way. So yeah, I do. Well, I have four dogs. Okay, right now. Uh, yes, I have. I have Sam Butters, which I've had them for twelve years. Too many, right? Those this are the reminds ones that. Reminds me of your first wife. I don't <laughs> know if it's real. <laughs> those are. 
Those are the ones that Theo says that I rented. Okay. Then I, you know, got with Kristen. She had a dog and that's Cooper. That's a big dog. Okay. Then we found a dog, which I've talked about on my podcast. Congratulations going over and subscribe to Super Cult. And well, I haven't posted about them in a long time, bro. Yeah. This Look, he got a kid now, so fuck them dogs. No, yeah, but, so that's yeah, what happened. I don't even see like it's like you you act like oh no, those are the other two. Those are the other two. This is hilarious though. But they're two of the four, so we can get it, you know. We're gonna do that. And we're gonna see if you are. This is so funny. Different. Watch this. Cooper on the right and Chen's, aka Trash Dog, on the left. We'll see what good boys you are. With I like his ears. Snack challenge. Watch this. Sit, sit. Watch this. Sit. No, no. Because there's food on the ground. No. You see it. Mm. You put a little treat down. Cooper's such a good boy. Now, what? Well, this is the dog. After him is the dog that we found. What so, a good boy he is, right? Yeah. Can we edit a little bit of this? Nah, thing? bro. Good you boy. keep the whole thing good in boy. cinematic. Good boy. You, you're a good boy. <laughs> now watch this. Hey. Now we do the Chen's thing. Cooper. Now we found Chen's in now, panorama. Now you, look, look at this yeah, motherfucker yeah, already. No, look, look, no, look. No. <laughs> now you take the trash no. panda. Watch, dog. watch, watch. No, no. He's no. like what? He's Wait, like, I'm never going to see food again. Goddamn motherfucker, asshole. <laughs> Dude. So, <laughs> now I do have those dogs. Now, okay. The other day, so here's the thing. Calvin has become my whole life. I'm not going to post pictures of the dogs, Wait, right? By, by the way, cut to, like, if you were to pan to the right, his his two dogs that he owns are just sitting there like this. <laughs> <laughs> no treat. What happened to us? <laughs> <laughs> so, hold on. Old news. So, hold on. So, I got the fucking, um, so, so I came home the other day and my... And Kristen was acting kind of, I always talk about how I don't like think about the dogs and how like I, I haven't fed the dogs in years. She does it, you know, or yeah, my assistant now. or something, right? Yeah. And I was, so it's a joke that like, you don't even give a fuck about the dogs. So Kristen uh, was being weird the whole time and like taking video of me. And uh, an hour later, she took video of me and she was like, do you notice anything different? And I was like, what? And she was like, do you notice how quiet it is? And I was like, what are you talking about? And she was like, is there anything different going on right now? And I was like, No. Oh, yeah, it is kind of quiet. And she's like, could you think about what it might be? And she got on video. I should post it. But she was like, the dogs aren't here. And I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, I don't even fucking think about the dogs. <laughs> where, I didn't even know. They How fucking horrible where is did that? They go? My assistant had them and fucking she was uh, there. There, there, there. there. Probably, that is, that's probably the last don't time. Don't say assistant, though. What do I say? Uh, I just say helper. Helper? Yeah. Helper? That's say, worse. Say helper. That's way worse. Isn't it? You, you could say the help. Oh, like that's the help? What are you like? <laughs> Oh, what look, is this? 1805? The help took my dogs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the help took the dogs for the day. That's bro that's uh, butters. Yeah, I do still have the dogs, but uh, I just don't post about them. Yeah, you're right. I mean, Mike Mike brings his dog here. The thing about Mike's dog, who's you know head of Thick Boy Production, his dog is 79 years old, blind. Yeah, no he's got team. cancer in six spots. Yeah, you know Mike just I mean? keeping this thing alive. The dog's yeah. like, bro, let me go. Yeah, yeah. And this Mike dog just is, keeps this, this dog thing is going. Trying to like, you get yeah. food out, and he just he can't see, and he has no teeth, and he just kind of like looks for it. <laughs> He's a real vibe killer. Yeah. <laughs> Whose dog is yeah, it? Man. Mike. 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 Uh, you had a, you had a yeah, Mike. It's like you, you're having some fun and then It'll the bum sick you dog out. comes in. <laughs> <laughs> you're kind of like, oh man. oh man, this is a downer. Uh, <laughs> and he, and dogs like, are supposed to be and he has like happy. two. He has yeah. like, king, king or sting it. Sick dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, King or sting it. Keeping your sick dog alive. Dude, so, yeah, on the back of his feet, like his hips have gone. Again, let Hip the thing go, dude. Yeah. Not, not even that. He's just 90. But he has he wears two crocs on the back of his fucking legs. Why? He gets to like skate across. Bro, that the dog, thing. you know what? That dog, I, I've seen, I, I, that dog's going to ha have a leash on him and then jump over a fence and just hang himself. <laughs> that happened once. And my, my uncle told me about that story. This dog fucking jumped. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bad person. Dude, dude my, my uncle is a fucking insane person. He always tells us shit like this. He's like, dude, I knew a dog that hung himself. And he jumped. This is like a Theo story. And the dog fucking was on the leash, jumped over a fence, and didn't, and, and was hang, hung himself. Wasn't <laughs> trying to get out. It was just like, <laughs> Jesus. Man. How awful is AC a yeah. dog fucking. The other person, you see the dog hung himself on the thing? <laughs> like it's the fucking Handmaid's Tail on the wall? Yeah. Huh. Jesus. You watch Handmaid's Tail? I, I'm trying to yeah, again another depressing show. Not, yeah, it's like I'd rather it. watch that show. First, first season's fine. It's no, it's all yeah. The first season's fine because it's you're so depressing. You, it takes twelve episodes to realize how fucking not really that good it is. <laughs> it's so boring. It's because you're like you're like all right, all right, taking its time. Okay, okay, yeah. and then you're like okay, and you go. All right, I'm out then, dude. If it's going to take fucking... It's like, when? I watched one what? season, I was out. I went, what okay. shows do you like? 
Well, I mean, obviously, Bad. Breaking, Breaking Bad, Soprano. Oh, let me say, it's what's, all what's so a new show? Is there no new show that you yeah, like? Yeah, hold on, there is. I, I started watching, um, ah, fucking, I, I honestly have the worst memory. Uh, Bates Motel? The no, Bates Motel guy? it's fine. Um, Good show. My favorite show ever to watch was Lost. To watch. Now, I know, I understand that that's not like at the oh, level as Breaking Bad. Oh, and honestly, yeah, thank you. But to watch it, uh, to watch it and to keep flipping that's and like next one, next one. For you, yes, then. exactly. That was um, like the original, like, serial long binge watching yeah. show. Yeah. 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 And I the ending, I just, I never watched it, like, stupid as shit. But the uh, the ending, everyone got all upset about, right? Just They're idiots. Fades to black or something. Well, yeah, They're idiots. All endings, it, it's not bad. Oh, endings it's are hard. hard to yeah. End yeah, 100%. It's like people shit on Game of Thrones season eight. I loved it. It's my favorite season. Oh, that was terrible. Stop. There you go. Go. Mm. That's the narrative. Yeah, mm. unbelievable, mm. unbelievably bad. Mm. The last season. Disagree. Uh, they got lazy. Capture. Lazy. Capture is a good show uh, on Peacock. You watch boring stuff, huh? No, that's BBC. <laughs> BBC is killing it, dude. Honestly, you don't watch um, Yellowstone, eighteen eighty three. Come on, dude. I don't watch it yet. I'll wait a few years. I wait till it's over and to see if Binge it held this the test of time. Oh, you know what was? And like then I watch one? it. What's that one? Oh man, mm. it's like a hole in the ground. It's a western. Oh yeah, with a. Uh, What's his name? Brolin? Brave James. Yeah. Oh, Josh West, Brolin. Josh Brolin. West no, Josh Brolin. No, no, no. Josh no. Brolin. It's like this, like. Oh, Men in Black 3. No, no, no. <laughs> Josh Spit Brolin. It's ideas. called like Underworld or some bullshit. Yeah, 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 Outer yeah, yeah. World. Outer World right. or Shadow World. Outer Range. Outer Range. You don't Outer fuck with, range, you don't fuck with like you. Ozark, Stranger I saw things. season one. It was good. Then I turn on season two. Sometimes with these Netflix shows, with these binge shows, like they wait too long to come out. And I'm like, all right, I I, I, I forget what happened. Bro, Dude, you know, I'm with you. Yeah. You know, you know what's good is that show Dark? Was that that German yeah, yeah, show? Yeah, 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 yeah. That show's fucking good. Good as shit, dude. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. What I don't like hey, about hey, binge watching. Hey, hey, do you have do you have anything current, dude? Well, that's, that's like, pretty current. Dark is pretty what current. What about something new? Um, like not so niche. I don't know. You, dark even, is, you won't watch Breaking Bad. Yeah, bro. This guy is niche <laughs> no, no, with no, his no. fucking. <laughs> I'm definitely not watching it. Well, what are you watching? <laughs> uh, name a show, dude. Stranger Things, Ozark, Boo! Narcos. Yellowstone. What? Narcos is AT Narcos is fine. <clears throat> Narcos is fine. But dude, they they, they need to stop. With the fucking voiceover, dude. The, the, there's so much. Vo it's like I know what I'm watching, motherfuckers. It's like oh, and the narcos. You speak Spanish? No, no, no. Well, that's why they have. No, 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 no. The fucking guy is like, and then the narcos was ahead of us there, and we went to the narcos, and then what the narcos didn't know was we were four steps ahead of them. It's like, dude, I'm watching the fucking show. <laughs> it's like you're watching the show, and someone's next to you, and like, dude, the guy's walking in the fucking. I thing like now. that. Not, you, you know why? Because you're an idiot. That's why. <laughs> Dude, you just watch the fucking show, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, 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 you didn't like Stranger Things? It's all style, baby. It's all style. Fuck oh, man. Sad. Look at this fucking Oh, that's my boy Austin. Yeah. He's a he's a great uh, music uh, musician. Wow, this is Popeye. He did the Arizona song that yeah. made Chris cry. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, can't, you can't listen can't to handle that. Crying. Is this the skill of Gilligan's Island? Chris, Theo, Eric, who's ever there this week because... You know, you guys were switching it up. It's not real. Um, I wanted to get a king it or sting it on my guy, my fearless leader, my mentor, my professor, Andrew Tate. Um, he's got a lot of hot takes that kind of got the internet in a little bit of a frenzy. Some would say he's a little bit sexist. Andrew I think Tate. he's just dropping knowledge. You don't know but, him? Yeah. I want to know. King oh, is that that sting funny Andrew guy? Tate. Gang gang. Cobra buzz Tate? buzz. Oh. Where? So. Wait, who is he? Hell yeah. Tate he's, a, is, he's, he's the, he, wasn't he a professional kickboxer? Yeah. He's yeah. like a real ladies man, like real alpha. He's, he's uh, I don't a, know him. He's oh, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy's I think funny, Tom the first one to have him up. Uh, uh, yeah. Segura's the first one to like bring him to the yeah, yeah, yeah. podcast world. It was it's, crazy. Like on all my social medias in like the last week, all of a sudden he's taken over right, like, right. every account. He's been on every show. But mm -hmm. he's, he's basically a one. pimp. Which is, I want to feel respected in the household. Okay. So, so I follow him on TikTok. meals, I'm assuming. Well, truthfully, I eat out most of the time. Yeah. But th this is actually one of the problems I have. I want you guys to feel sorry for me. Maybe with your big channel, we can start a charity and get some money going. Because you know what happens now? What? My life, uh, you know, I'm flying on private jets. I'm eating in all these restaurants. I'm driving all these supercars. And it's very hard for me to find a way for women to show me 
Right. Respect, because they're just like on the jet, duh. I go to the restaurant, duh. They're in the club, duh. Well, that's what yeah. I'm saying. Do you know what I mean? And they're like, so, and, and most dudes are happy just get mad pussy. He makes get sounds. rid of that. He goes, get rid of, he he goes in and out of the yeah. English accent American, right? Yeah. No, this guy, ma- this guy? This guy's made some fucking phenomenal points, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> he really uh, has. Like, I mean, he. I, I I think a lot of it is character, but like, I mean, it, you like know. what's his points? Oh, yeah, he'll do points like about the government and just talk about oh, really? fuck, yeah, everything. Yeah. And I'm like, huh. I, I, and everybody's like, huh. I've heard of him. <laughs> His big thing is being, uh, he uses the Matrix as like an analogy for today's society. And you have, to detach, for, you have to detach from the Matrix. Otherwise, you get caught by the government, uh, like during COVID, all the restrictions. Yeah. But he's become independently wealthy where he has 11 pa- passports. He could fly over all over the world during COVID. And he's not like uh, captive to societal pressures i don't know because well, he, he has so much money though yeah he, he, him and every rich dude how does he have so much money uh he his first thing like his, him and his brother yeah they manage webcam girls mm. and now he's like just parlaying it and he has hustlers university which uh i talked to austin he's he subscribed for 50 bucks a month and he teaches how to get people 50 get wealthy bucks a month yeah and he's got like i don't know he's he said on dave portnoy show he has eighty seven thousand monthly Shit. subscribers he could totally be lying well everyone always lies yeah it's yeah. just to get hoes uh and yeah, no, money. be successful. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. but you could sign up for that. Mm-hmm. Just hose, get hose. But like he's, he's also polarizing because people say he's misogynist and stuff. But he's an entertainer for sure. Yeah, it's an, but it's an act. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Says Tom spit coffee out of his nose. Yeah. Here's the here's the part. Of that. Get rid of that. Stupid that shit. won't respect oh, wow. me. Crap. That's not real. Is that yeah. real? Really? I, you know what? So many women say to me, "You're so Andrew. Jeez. You know what? You're so rich, but you're smart, and you're actually very intelligent, and I know you'd get really bored of, a, like, a robot. And I'm sitting there thinking, bitch, I wish to God you were a robot. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. We talk about star signs? Oh, yeah, I'm so glad. Tell me more about by Sagittarius rising, you idiots. I don't give a fuck. Give me a robot. All men want robots. That's all we want. Yeah. Four wives, robots, inshallah. Put yeah. the... Put the put the burk on. Yep. What are you talking about? We don't care. Two. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You know. Trip. Eric's not a fa- Eric. You're not feeling it. Eric signed up. <laughs> <laughs> I have two accounts. I have a ghost account. No, he's, <laughs> he make sure I'm getting all the. <laughs> no, that, it's just, he's, he's, he's a just character. Of, I mean, he's a character. Yeah, he's he's, he's learned things. how to hustle it, so yeah. I, I, I appreciate it. Yeah. So look, uh, MMA fans, I got. I got to talk to you about something. I'm glad we took this break. But uh, as the fighters face off during UFC 277, you can take down your own big win with DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of UFC. This Saturday, new customers can bet $5 on any fighter to win and get, (laughs) I know it sounds ridiculous, but it's true, $100 in free bets. Win or lose. Oh my God, you want even more action? If that didn't get your beak wet, you can also double your winnings on a same game parlay, all right? Combine multiple bets like which fighter will win, how long the fight will last, and so much more. Just place your bets on UFC 277, same fight parlay if it hits you'll win double. DraftKings is safe, secure, reliable. Best of all, you can deposit, withdraw your cash whenever you want, Daddy. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app now. Use promo code CATS, K-A-T-S. Bet $5 on any UFC 277 fighter to win and get $100 in free bets no matter what. That's code K-A-T-S, CATS, this Saturday at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of UFC. Minimum age and eligibility that's always hard to say. I, I struggle with it myself. Minimum age and eligibility, eligibility restrictions apply. apply. See show notes for details. See next page for directions for disclaimer. What up, King? Staying in the wing. In the woo, woo, woo. Sitting there. I got a debate club for you fellas today. If this guy can't sing. What is more what a shame. morally corrupt? Ricky Martin hanging out, banging out his nephew. Banging out. Who knows? It's going to be a debate. Or the honest guy truth of Elon's dad, raw dog and old stepdaughter, and having a baby. Well, that's news to me. I'm going to go ahead and say yeah, they got the stepdaughter that thing. That's a bit weird, man. It's been going you on. You accepted that as a child, and now you're having a child. So I'm going to let you fellas decide. Whew. Nick, Brendan, Theo, Chin, Mark, Chris. Is this, I almost forgot you, bud. Is this Everlast? You guys figure this out <laughs> for me. Let me know. Is that Bubba Sparks? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, all right. So, so Ricky Martin was he, having a seven-month relationship with his 21-year-old nephew. Well, hold on. No. But, but his nephew uh, reneged on the deal and was like, "That I, I made it all up. 
Yeah, I he think that that's... He stopped pressing charges, and yeah. Ricky was, like, dancing last night. I'm not night. sure about that one at all. But That one I know. Yeah, he, he but, reneged on it, was like, mm, just playing. And I then, don't think the nephew is denying that they had a relationship, though. No. He's <sighs> denying that he was, like, raped and... And he received Stocked. death threats, like multiple death threats. The police oh said that he was God. getting death threats if he showed up. Okay, and then Elon's dad at 76 confirmed secret second child with his stepdaughter. So, yeah. okay, hold on. Let me try and figure this out. So they this have is two kids, by the way. So his, oh, wait, before you figure out, let me, let me help you. Uh, Ricky Martin, the, the, the nephew, is from his stepsister's side, so it's not blood. Oh, it's not? No. But they were trying to charge oh, him with goodness. incest. And my problem what? with that situation, let me tell you my problem with it. Now all these details are coming out, mm -hmm. but it didn't matter because it was already sensationalized on the news. Yeah. And he was like thought of as whatever. And and now it's like, you know, is he it, that's out there. Yeah. Oh, uh, definitely. Well, did. That's damn it. Here's my thing: is like if 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 this kid, you know, adult, young adult male is getting abused or whatever it is like that if it's real get the facts it's too important you can't just put some shit out and 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 you know well, but that's tmz yeah somebody. they don't give a fuck but that's the, I know, social but media like, in a nutshell though. i know but it's like get the story right i think it's that's important. the problem there's no credibility and then also they blast all shit out without looking into it but then also like you guys didn't know that was uh his step like he's not even blood related like i'm not saying it's right but it's not his blood relative yeah so it was now a step they, well that's so all, now people, that only matters though that only matters when it comes to like he can't be charged with incest but here's the thing forget that it's inappropriate okay yeah and that's all that's he he did something inappropriate and the kid was involved too so they did something that was just out of pocket and that's their business living yeah. the vida loca yeah oh, wait, that's uh, their uh, business uh, uh, the, the person was 21 how old was he it don't, he's, he's like 40, but hold on. Yeah. You say it's inappropriate, but yeah, if, because, because it's, it's inappropriate? It's because it's a family You know it's not against the law, right? right? It's, you know, you know You're what I mean? saying it's for the family to figure out. It's about. for the yeah, family yeah, to yeah, figure yeah, out. Yeah. If I'm Ricky Martin, you know what I'm saying? But then also, they're not going to get clicks. Like, did you guys know that the the nephew dropped the charges? No, because that yeah. doesn't get clicks. But how fucked up is that? It doesn't I get know. clicks, dude. But not like I say, not everybody has. Like, if Ricky Martin wants to, like, you know, sue for defamation or whatever it is like that, not everybody has that kind of money, man. You need yeah. all the money. Oh, yeah, you need Ricky you Martin need money, money to yeah. do that shit. You yeah. need Johnny Depp he, he money to do that stuff. He might not even have that kind of money. Yeah, he, might not, he might not. Uh, I bet he does. He, he, might, he might not. Johnny Depp has He bought it. that shit for six years. He probably spent more money on the loft fees than he's going to get back from her. Johnny mm -hmm. Depp? Yeah. But yeah, we, but every, we, I mean, dude, bro, in this community and all the communities, bro, you, I mean, Chris Brown, everyone's getting this shit. And it's like to, to have that money and fight that shit, fine. But like, if you don't have millions and millions upon, and millions upon millions of dollars, you can't fight that shit. I know. No. Yeah. And then here's the thing even if you do fight and you win, unless you're Johnny Depp, if you're just n normal, you know, mm -hmm. like C, B list, or mm -hmm. especially for your comic, and mm -hmm. you beat it, mm -hmm. that doesn't get traction. No, it doesn't. They're not yeah, going to yeah, report yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. So, so it's really, then, there's no upside. So then the other thing is like, I think, I believe that Elon Musk's father has two kids with this chick. Yeah. So, what, so for me, the sec, now that, because they have two, I don't give a fuck about it. Really? Yeah, because you they have two. Have one, you're good? Yeah, because that means <clears throat> it's an established relationship at this point now. And you love each other? Yeah, you mm. can't just have two kids. If you have right, one kid, right, right. I whoops. You, whoops. Could be whoops. Oops. Could be. Right? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> but <Okay>. two? <laughs> if yeah. you have two kids, they're in a thing, and they're just like, that's why no one cares. Yeah. So wait, okay, so it's what happened? Weird. So it's his stepdaughter, which means it's his- Second wife's uh, daughter oh. from a previous marriage. And he's not with that wife anymore, And he had obviously. an affair with <laughs> the stepdaughter and left the mom? I don't know what happened this first. This is frowned upon too, Eric, where I come from. Yeah. But it's inappropriate. It's, I agree It's inappropriate, yeah. But, but I'm saying that's still their family business. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah. like this. Yeah. yeah, I'm living. I got my two kids and my girl. Why y'all care? Mm. You know? Mm. What do y'all... Yeah, okay. Wait, but how old was she when they had when they first had... Uh, she was... Uh, when he met her, the girl was four years old. Okay. So he was like that. He had, there's a 45. Because Elon, Elon flying to Mars and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like Four years old? Yeah, that's wild. Four, so you raise that kid and then you have an affair with her? That is creepy. Mm. I know. But I'd I, say but they, Elon's worse. Elon's dad's worse. Yeah. He's 70, 76 and she's 35 right now. Oof. I don't know if he was like. And the oh. first baby was 2019, so she was 32. But they knew each other. Are they still yeah. together? It looks like it. Yeah, then it's like, oh, well, they should have been together, not the mom and him anyway. That's hilarious. Here's a yeah, cat. He had to wait. You know what I mean? 
Here's a Cats mm. in the Wild. Someone said their dog looks like Chris. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's fucking funny. <laughs> Same forehead, huh? That's funny. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why was your hair like that? Um, I was, I got, I almost got the part of don't be drinking your juice in the hood of oh, South nice. Central. <laughs> I actually I don't know. Coolio. I think, I think I did that for Calvin. Oh yeah. No, Coolio Marlon did that. Wayans. Look up Marlon Wayans. That's Marlon Wayans. No, Marlon Wayans in the, the thing, which. Yeah. Great movie. Um, not, probably not a great movie. No, I haven't seen it, but. I, well, as soon as I said great, I was like, oh, I wish they I have funny moments. Yeah. yeah. Do they? Yeah. I don't know. I, I, like, I, I have a funny moment in a movie where like a, a, a guy's talking to his kid, uh-huh. but the kid, the, the dad's younger than, you know. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. There's some funny that's shit in funny. that movie. Yeah. yeah. Not a great movie. I used to love spoof movies, man. They yeah, but no, them. but it, like Naked Gun era. No, even um, not even not like scary, the first scary movie. No, hilarious. Oh, I no, thought it was funny. Dude, no. the first scary movie Handsome? is fucking no. funny, dude. Come on. No. Or the other one is Not Another Teen Movie. That no. shit oh, no. is not good. That's oh, you're crazy. No. That's right, not Another Teen Movie no. is hilarious. No. I was with you on Come scary on, movie. No. When, when, when they funny. go, when, when they're like looking, like they're making fun of that whatever movie where they're like, all right, let, uh, here's the bet. You uh, you have to make that person the prom, prom queen. And then it's like, they go, that guy? And it's like a fucking hunchback. Dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's too easy. What about oh, you know, that's funny, yeah. the Siamese twins? Yeah. No, that's too easy. Then it's like a girl with a ponytail and glasses. Yeah. Ew. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, yeah. That's, the, it, it, that's fun funny when you tell it. Yeah. It's the not black funny. Guy in the, it's at the not party funny in the movie. Was like, yo, man, I'm the I'm the one black guy. <laughs> yeah, choking black guy. I thought I'm the sc- one black guy. That, y'all are crazy. You gotta watch that. No, again. I like. No, the you scary, are funny telling it. All scary movies are pretty funny too. Like no, the, the third zero part with, with the aliens. Yeah, and man. Their, their dicks are on their fingers, and they didn't realize it. And that guy's talking. You just put his fingers up, like this, <laughs> and he's going like this. He's like, oh, their dicks, are, their penis are actually on their fingers. Like, Come on, it's funny fuck? moments, man. I don't know. I, like, but, I, I only like, saw. I, little, I do like recommend everyone one, to go watch Airplane, but not if you're woke. If you're woke, don't watch it. Like Airplane couldn't get made today. Oh no way! Yeah, can make no way. Airplane is so. See that the is thing one about the the, this is the thing fucking I, movies the, ever, the, the, bro. When they say like, oh fuck, uh, like uh, I'm nervous when he's on the plane. They're like, oh yeah, you, you uh, you've have you ever flown? Wait, wait, what is it? Have you ever, before, what is it? Wait, I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm nervous. And he's on the plane. He says, I'm nervous. He says, first time? He says, no, I've been nervous lots of times. <laughs> like, that kind so of stupid. humor <laughs> yeah. kills me, bro. Yeah, so when stupid. the old lady comes over, the black guy's talking. The jive yeah, talk? Yeah, the old, old lady comes over. It's okay. I speak jive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she yeah, you uh, can't do that movie too. Oh, my God. No, you ne- uh, never, bro. That, that movie's so funny. Uh, Naked Gun's so funny. Leslie Nielsen, they, that <laughs> was a diamond, bro. He was, Dude, that guy. Dude, the umpire? Oh, fuck, bro. See, I want to make it. They need to bring sp- spoof movies But back. they don't do. But even the scary movies and the fucking, they weren't like that, really. See, I want to make John Thick. <laughs> oh, wow. That's hilarious. <laughs> you know what I mean? <clears throat> it's like, are you retired? Dude, I'm never working. <laughs> remember, yeah, yeah, yeah. remember OJ Simpson's a naked gun? He had a yeah. big part. Wow, yeah. When, Leslie Nelson, Mr. Poopy Pants, when he did that. Mm. Oh, fucking so funny. Who's that? Leslie Nelson's son? <laughs> yeah. Who is this? Uh, just a sting? submitter. Oh, okay, cool. Let's do it. This looks like one of your hey, videographers. Is he a vampire? I'm <laughs> calling you from Victoria, BC. Uh, Chris, we miss you here, man. I saw you a few years ago when you came, and it was amazing. Oh, uh, Victoria? hope you come back. Maybe yep. come in the summertime when it's not so yeah. fucking cold. Mm. Yeah. Gets up to a uh, decent temperature, I guess. I'm calling you with a debate club today that me and my girl came up with. Would you rather have your knees never bend again or your elbows never bend again? Oh, oh knees. Pretty dicey. Either of those are yeah. terrible, terrible you can't options. Eat. But I think one's less terrible. Yeah, you had to love oh, sure. to see what you guys think. Yeah, you would. I'm sure you had to be knees. Some hilarious debates, Nick Wait. and Chin, and yeah. Mark that big yeah, fucking hairy ogre. Get him in on this as well. Oh, it's tough. <laughs> you gotta call and yeah, yeah. You can't do anything. Wait, so you guys are saying knee? You rather have it your knees be, never bro. bend? Yeah, yeah, because you can still no. walk. Yeah, you can. Yeah, like a fucking scarecrow. All right, so go ahead. Work, work through it. Go yeah, ahead. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. so your arms. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. How are you gonna eat? Uh-huh. You'll never have a private conversation ever again because you always gotta be on speakerphone. Uh-huh. Uh huh. You can't wipe your ass. You can't drive. You can drive like this. Yeah. yeah. You have to be like way far back on the, on the thing. Walking at least like you can. Yeah, yeah, I agree. You, you can't, you can't be. In your, so you, uh, you're not driving there either. You, you what car are you gonna get with your legs? Yeah, are you also you couldn't sit out? in a car again. There's no plane ride. I think you can still private. drive. I think you can still drive. I think you what can still drive. What are you talking drive. about? You're, you'd have Custom to have to take seat. the front seat out, and you have to sit in the back seat. <laughs> no, you just put it all the way back, and just use your fucking 
Fides. No, no, no. no, you get one of those like you people yeah. don't have any arms. Yeah, and you have to drive like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right, bro. There, there is no qu <laughs> question. I'd rather have my knees not bent. <laughs> oh, I don't have my arms, bro. You are not thinking <laughs> You're not about thinking this. It through. You're not, You're not thinking, thinking it through. through man. You're just going like, I want to run. <laughs> That'd be nice. But but no, it, but it, it, this one we're gonna be running like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> running like this, <laughs> and then and then you're sweating, but you can't wipe your own forehead. <laughs> <laughs> I need someone out. Wipe it with your feet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Plus, you're going to pull your hamstring. What the fuck was that? I don't know. You're going to pull your hamstring and shit, and you're not going to be yeah, able to do gonna, either. All right. Yeah, you're not going to be able to massage your Either throat. way, it fucking suck. Well, yeah, man. It sucks. Like, this guy couldn't wipe his head, and he should. Yeah. Oh, wow. He should. Look at his shirt's lit. What up, my dudes? The thing standing. Oh, he's working out. The wing in the sink. Shout out, Brandon. For this weekend here in San Diego, super dope. I was thinking in a team setting for a debate club, can you do more push ups? Theo and Chris or Brendan and Eric? Yeah. Let me know what y'all think. Gang, gang. Who could do more push ups, Theo and Chris or Brendan and Eric? Yeah. He's my photographer in San Diego. He's really talented. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's good. Um, he's a photographer. He doesn't know much about audio. You can't really do a video with so much <laughs> fucking. That's why he's a photographer. Yeah. <laughs> he's a specialized um, in audio. He's a cool dude. Uh, yeah. Who push can do push-ups? You and, you and Theo. Uh, well, the weakest link, it would be me and Theo is the weakest link. So it just depends on how many push-ups can you do versus him. Because he would have to do more push-ups than you. To make up for it. To make up for it. But I, I mean. Right. Theo works out. I could do some push-ups. Yeah, but also, are you, I know you're really strong, but you're also very big. Yeah. So are push-ups your thing? Pretty good at push-ups. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I like the confidence that you came with. Okay. <laughs> yeah. um, and how many would I have to do? I think I could get twenty-five in. Yeah. It, then if you're really good at push-ups, you get twenty-five. Well, what's good? Well, to you? I wonder what's, if what's good to you. Like, I don't how know, many do you think you can do? Right now, not as. I mean, I, I've been slacking. So, uh, but Theo could could get, do, probably do a bunch. You think you can do a bunch? Yeah, that's Theo's a upper body is like Kermit the Frog. Like that's I'm, true. I'm the weakest link in this. <laughs> that's true. Thing, which is unfair, but you know. Can, can we do it next Tuesday? I'll put it. I'll put oh, it out. Man, I'm down. <laughs> I'm gonna beat the shit know. out of you. Guys. My nose, you no know. No pressure. <laughs> my nose. Yeah, let's is, do a push up contest. My nose, <laughs> nose. My nose is still healing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's do a push up contest next my week, nose is and still then healing, let's have guys. Chris and this guy do a headbutt contest. Yeah, I mean, this guy, dude. <laughs> you you know your angles, buddy, bro. My God, know your this angles, bro. All nose and forehead. <laughs> Shaving those armpits. Shaving those forehead. Can't stand it. Does he have Botox? It's the most uncomfortable feeling ever. Well, why Letting did you him go out? It's a little disgusting. You know what, like I'm more of a guard guy myself. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Manscaped. So Promo can you it? He shaved CFC. his armpits? Pit maintenance. Is that what he's talking about? Yeah. Pit maintenance. He said, do you just let it grow out or do you shave it? I have to shave my you have. You don't want, you don't want, the, nothing's more disgusting. But I don't disgusting. shave it, if you're I don't the shave it like where it's out. bald. No. I just get my like, you know, the little whatever trimmer just, so, just you, gets so you trim it. I trim it. I get mine a Philly fade. Oh, I've yeah. never trimmed my armpits in my life. Because you don't really grow disgusting. a lot of hair there. No, I bet he's hairy. No, 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 no. not there. Not my there. bottom half is crazy, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they yeah, filmed Jumanji down. in my butthole. <laughs> For real. It's so crazy. My butthole is insane. Harry. Kevin Hart, The Rock, and that chick from the Marvel movies in there. Oh and whoever God. else was in that movie. You never just uh, want to take like, a, a, a three guard to that asshole? Like the, the taint? Nah, hands? but like... Um, no, because you can't really see it. You can't it see it, bro. It's patchy, it's right? I, maybe I've tried it. performance package has a light on it. <laughs> yeah, for who? You can't see back there. Yeah. What do you have like a webcam set up? Like what do you have your girl do? Like, 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 like it's a, like you're at the fucking ENT. <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking? I mean, it's not hairy, dog. <laughs> the guy's fucking with uh, like, like, like the ENT. When you're hairy, you're just hairy, and it's stupid. Like I'm a hairy guy, so it's like your it's dumb to like what you know. Certain you like it's like at a certain point, it's like it is what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, You're so like I try to get this area, upper back, you know. Unreal. Yeah. Do you get got... random patches? Or yeah, is... yeah, yeah, yeah. And I have like, in, like right above my butt, I have the like patch? a patch of duck tail. Making... Yeah, you uh, know what I mean? You... So I got to get rid That's because I got a back injury. Are that's you... what someone told Please me Please stop once. sneezing. Are I've never uh... hurt my back and I got it, so. Are your shoulders hairy, Eric? Yeah. 
just not I mean, majorly yeah, hairy. Yeah, hair like no. Andre Alosky. No, no, no. <laughs> I don't have. It's just like I have weird back patches, which just sucks. So, <laughs> so does Nick. Yeah. Back patches, and they Ew. just keep springing up like every yeah. day. It's like, you just, you so just, just so I just stand in the shower naked, and then Rachel just. Wow, back, dude, you know that's I mean? marriage right there. Yeah. <laughs> back patches. You just chill, and you hear, and you go, Rachel, we got another one. <laughs> And then you hear in the background. No, it's yeah. like the guy when they shave him from Monsters. It's yeah. Such a dad reference, but in Monsters yeah. they shave the hairy guy. Mm. He's oh naked. yeah, yeah, it's just like that. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get her sing it for you guys. Moving into an apartment before you have furniture. I moved into this apartment like four weeks ago. I still don't have a couch, but um, I got this in my living room. Oh, that's fucking hilarious, bro. <laughs> don't ask me why. what. Um, also, I'm gonna <laughs> a take dude. this opportunity to call out. Theo Vaughn. Okay, Theo. We seen Stevie Weeby with the wrestling match. We seen it, okay? I want you in a wrestling match. I'll drive to Nashville. I'll come to LA. What? Doesn't matter. I think I could take you. I seen you wow. train. I see you training all the time. He's nice. But the dude, bike is hilarious. The bike is hilarious. That that's such a dude. To not have a couch, but have your motorcycle <laughs> in the living room? Well, I'll tell you that's what, a, That's man. a dude move. I, I have a buddy of mine. Hey, You're just long, watching the TV on the fucking motorcycle? Yeah, no, that's definitely manly. Hey, how long are we going to pretend he's not going to wrestle Theo and lick his asshole? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Right? Yeah. Um, my buddy just got his bike stolen right in front of his place. Uh, you know? Bike like bicycle or like No, motorcycle? no, like that. You know? And his other friend has had a Ducati that got stolen. They, they're just, it doesn't matter what, they're just taking them. Yeah. And here's the thing, too. The technology... The laws haven't caught up to technology because mm -hmm. right. his other friend put a air yeah. tracker on yeah. it and uh -huh. told the cops, "Here it is. Yeah, it's in this." And they, what they do is they put them in apartments just like that. Oh, so they don't get jacked? Yeah, they can't. No, I'm saying, but they're, they're thieves. They take it. And they See, put he stole it that in the apartment. So. <laughs> <Get jacked. laughs> oh, so they can't come in and get it. Yeah, they can't come oh, in and get it. They can't see oh, it. Oh yeah. shit, that's hilarious. So, so, this guy's so a you're thief. showing the cops, like, look, I know it's here, but they, have, they but don't have to be have a fair. Warrant. Cops, especially in LA, are like, oh, your bike got stolen. Listen, we've had 19 people get shot in the face. No, they don't we'll even get say to that. It they when go we get like, to it. We have 19 people shot in the face, and we don't even care about that. I know. But here's the thing, though. What I'm saying, though, is like, you, you know. You guys defunded the police. They need to just have like a the, the, the laws are, need to upgrade to like yep. you know it, it should be a kind of thing. It's like if I have a tracker on my bike and I can show you that it's right here, that should be probable cause. Yeah, but the technology moves so quick that the I laws know. can't move that quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. can't move. Well, laws don't even move at all. Well, right, yeah. I, I yeah, feel yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. I just got freed. Right, you know right, I mean? right, right, like, right, you know? right, right. You're not, but yeah. <laughs> 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 I, by the way, but getting back to this guy's yeah, crazy Sting point, though, I <laughs> remember when I first moved into my uh, my last place, I didn't have furniture either. And I just, mm. I was like, I was so excited to I like, love be it, an yeah. adult. To be empty in yeah, that yeah, apartment, yeah. like, hell yeah, dude. You always feel like I made it, no I matter had my what. TV with a PlayStation <laughs> on the yep. ground. You know what I mean? There you go. Roof, real bachelor pad. That's yeah. super fucking, dude. Like, I, mean, I love it. Yeah. Hey guys, Aww. the Cross family here. We have a debate club question for you. The pool versus the beach. Oh. <laughs> gang, gang, buzz, buzz. No, listen. Oh my God. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Aww. Wow, so they good. have a big fucking pool, huh? Is that a public first all, pool? First of all, we, we need to talk about, there's so many factors here. Uh-huh. Okay. Where is the beach? That's a community pool. Yeah. Let's say a YMCA. Community pool, okay. Like, where's the beach? Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. And that question, too. Is it your pool? Mm. Mm. Ah, okay. Yes. You know True. What I mean? Yeah. I would say, well, anywhere where you don't have to deal with fucking sand in your anus is great, <laughs> right? It's a plus. So you don't go to the beach. Food. You bring food to the beach. You're, all of a sudden, you're like, you get that fucking... You're like, oh, Weren't I ate sand. Were you just at the beach, though, with your no. kiddo? Uh, well, well no, no, no. I went... You know you fucked up, right? What do you mean by going? <laughs> no, you know, I'm just saying you're, you're they're staying in the beach, but no, I stay. No, I'm, I'm. They're saying, but it's the bait club. So if, if my son wants to go to the beach, I go to the beach because whatever for my son, yeah. okay? <laughs> but sand and ass and all. Yeah, dude, I'll put sand in it. Yes, <laughs> okay, me too. But uh, if my son wants to go to the beach, we go to the beach, dude. Yep. Okay. Now, <laughs> I try to convince him. Your maybe we go to the pool, right though. Now. Maybe pool? we go to the pool. It's a mine. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> okay? If we got to go to a community on, pool, then you it. go to the beach. Sting it. Rich you assholes go to the beach. with pools. <laughs> then you go to the beach. My hair's crazy yeah, right now. Your hair's fucking insane. Uh, if it's a community pool, uh, sting that because I grew up in community pools. You do pee-pee yeah. in there. Oh, your boy shit in the pool. <laughs> Illegal. <laughs> Not when you're six, baby. No, nah, dude. When you're six, oh, it's cute. You this do says so much pool. about, the, you know. Nope. See, you don't even know the background. You don't know the background. I went to. There's where no. <laughs> we don't need to know any background. Yeah. For why you shit in the pool? <laughs> no. no we, we, Hey, we got a new no segment. There's no justification. No, no, there is, though. No, we got a new segment. Hero or not. Listen to this. <sighs> we grew up, my dad would drop us off. Right? He was working nine to five. So every summer he dropped us off at the YMCA. They used to force us to swim every fucking day. After about three weeks of swimming that we didn't want to do, my brother, older me, goes, you know what? You should take a shit in the pool. I bet we don't have to swim. I go, all right. I got to take a big old shit. So I swam to the deep end. And then my brother was like, all right, you do it. And then we do it. Just wink at me and I'll yell, turd. So I took a big hot shit and he yelled, turd. Nobody had to swim for the rest of the summer. Your boy was camp MVP. Hero or not? <laughs> First of up. all, do you up. think there's That's any gangster, part bro. of that story <laughs> is like. <sighs> That's gangster. That's gangster. Like to be a six-year-old gangster like that? Oh, my. my older you brother. You're endorsing this? No. Yes, I yes, don't you think that yes, you should you, do it. You would have shit in the pool for Matt? Hold on a second, bro. Okay, so you would have shit in the pool for Matt. Hold on a second. Would you have shit in the pool for Absolutely. Matt? I would have had Matt do it for me. And I will tell you this. <laughs> dude, and I will tell you older. this. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> what my brother told me, I do. <laughs> I'm a goddamn YMCA legend for this. Oh, my God. I will tell you this, dude. Imagine you got two kids, all right? Uh, now, we've got kids. You'll have kids. When you have a kid, it's a little different. There's stuff that you feel about the kid. You realize yourself in the kid, and you're proud of the kid for a lot of different things. Now, look at it this way, dude, okay? So you've got two kids, and one of the kids shits in the pool. Now, on its face, that's bad, okay? Mm -hmm. but Terrible. then when the kid <laughs> says, dude, I did it for my brother MVP. because I didn't want... He didn't want to swim anymore, and I have his back. Yes. Then there's a secret sense of pride that yes. you have. Yep. <laughs> oh, I think there's a secret sense of pride that you have yes. because your son is looking out for your other sibling for their other sibling, and that's some nice that's some Game of Thrones shit, honestly. First of all, it's a brilliant move. People thought it was a baby. It move. is bad. First of all, his You're... brother did that to make his stupid little brother shit in public. <laughs> <laughs> This wasn't for any kind of heroism. He was like, I bet you I can get my... He probably told his friends, I bet you I can get Brendan to shit in the pool. <laughs> the secret pride for the prank. This is how we know Eric didn't have a brother growing Because my brother was like, bro, we don't want to, you know, we don't want to swim. This is how we got to get out of this. We didn't so swim then, so you're for the rest of the now. summer. So what? So what, what? What? What did you guys do? Nobody knew it was me, Daddy. Come on, bro. bro. You're a bad. You were a bad kid. Bro. No, no, no. He no, was, I was a, a bad kid. kid. No, no, no. You were a good down homie. Yeah. You're a bad kid. Yeah. No, you're a down ass kid. homie, right? But you're a bad somebody kid, knew. bro. Somebody, if somebody knew it was you. It got out. That was out now. <laughs> Why I'm saying, hey, excuse, you're the one that shit in the pool in 1994. <sighs> wow. You're going to find out somebody lost their sight. Oh, wow. Yeah, this guy. What's up, King Sting and the Wing and the Sing? I had the beach chilling. I mean, the Thought most regular it. tattoos. Sting for you. Turning up, getting drunk. He's got a devil in an eight ball. Knowing you got to pregnant DD <laughs> to drive you home. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, sore. Eric, I'm not finna woo woo because there's too many people out here. I ain't gonna embarrass myself. Yeah, you're so. Oh, you're already it. embarrassing yourself. <laughs> yeah, I think the tattoos <laughs> did it, my man. You don't want to embarrass yourself? You have on a dumbass hat <laughs> <laughs> with your pregnant wife while you on the phone, like <laughs> <laughs> talking, <laughs> talking to us, <laughs> talking to us. Look at this. Oh my god, this guy's a trip. He dude. said, "I ain't finna to do it, man." And this is why we don't go to the beach. There it is, right there. <laughs> there you go, man. He's not. But again, there's Chris in the background with Calvin. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but to, to Eric's point, it depends on the beach. It depends on the beach. It just, yeah, this the beach the, doesn't look nice. Yeah, this isn't the beach. And she's just trying to just rest. <laughs> and he's like, hey, you going to drive me home, bro? I'm about to get hammered. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's fucking... Uh, 
Oh God, that I, whole thing is such a mess. Yeah, that was that was very problematic. This whole video. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not into it. This guy's got a ton of energy. All right, let's see. Hey guys, this is Gabriel calling from Hot as Balls, Arizona. Ooh, too yeah. hot. Um, too hot. Who's, who's hand is board that? Games. If you king it, which is the best board game? Thank you guys. Have a great day. <laughs> First of all, he has the thickest fingers. Whose hand is that? Guy? That's not his hand. Someone else went in. Yeah. Like that. Someone Somebody's like that. got on like a, ba- a baseball glove. <laughs> <laughs> oh, his fingers. Thick. He got thick. That boy got brought. And he's only got fingers. three fingers, I think. Is that right? Is that- <laughs> yeah, he's like a cartoon. He's a cartoon. Did a cartoon call him? Yeah, is that Homer Simpson's hand? Dude, check out how thick his pinky is. It's no, a big toe. Dude, <laughs> Mickey, Mi- Mickey Mouse is next to him, just like. <laughs> well, I know what you need, man. When no, you get an itch, uh, no, his, his hand looks like a hamburger, and then five bratwurst fucking out from dude. him. God, he got. He must Look be that fighter. pinky, bro. Oh. That pinky is like, oh my god. Got, he's like that guy, the arm wrestling champ with the big ass yeah, hands. You know what I'm talking about? Hand, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, it's like three of Brendan's ears. <laughs> <laughs> Zero board games. B O R E D. That's how are you spell you it. Zero. Me? Zero, dude. Board games are fun. Zero. No They're monopoly for, people. for you. They're for, board- They're for people who don't want to have a conversation and laugh. Thank you very much. Next one, dude. Boring, dude. I can't stand board games. That's what fucking people who don't have personalities do. Yes, we figured it out. Next one. <laughs> are you kidding me? I used to play a board game with my mom all the time called Aggravation. It was this marble board game. And it was the fun, one of my fondest memories. Oh, that's sweet. Too bad you guys didn't fucking talk. <laughs> <laughs> you, you just sat with your parents and just talked. That's why I'm so fucking interesting these days. Oh, my God. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I, I got Bill's number. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> I like a good game of Monopoly. Thank Around you. The no, dude. Oh, let me tell you. Here's another thing too. That's a fun yes, thing. We're figuring it out. I like to get Baltic Avenue. Get the, the fuck out of here in with the hood Baltic. And build, yeah. and build hotels. Fuck off, dude. Build play, real we hotels. We should play Monopoly. That's Listen. a fun game. Ooh, yeah, that brought Eric it back. It takes too long though. Yeah. Yeah, that was it. Oh, you, you didn't like the? It's not. I guess it's not a board game. But remember the surgery game where you would have the tweezers? You touch the side. Just the, eh. operation. The, the only yes. game. Happy happy hippo. The only. Games I'm willing to play are any games where you don't have to like oh, fucking keep track or write down or like <laughs> build or like if I got I can I think about can I think it what what number am I at right now six okay I'm at nine I'm not filling shit out with those jerky fucking small pencils that are it never works. sharp I'm not fucking keeping a list of shit I'm not building anything I don't want to no carefully charade, do no shit for you. Jenga too stressful. I'm chilling. My personality is fancy, dude. And we could talk all day long. But the second you got to have Jane me build shit. Stressful. First of all, is anyone else talking you when pussy. you're doing a, or is it just you doing a performance? It's a lot of that, but I will say. <laughs> yeah, it's fun just for Chris. Yeah. They're like, yeah. He doesn't want to play board games because he's like, hey, yeah. I'm the Monopoly right here. <laughs> I got a new bit for everybody. They're like, hey, Chris, will you shut up for a second? Yeah, you're that Jenga? annoying kid. Yeah, dude. But a fucking dude, I do it for profession. So, congr- how? Happy. Dude, you get this for free now, dude. I'm just talking. God. This is my him job. At, him at Thanksgiving as a kid, everybody's just like going like, oh, God. <laughs> Chris, is, Chris is doing a performance, everybody. Some of them the living yeah, room. Yeah, yeah. Some of them the turkey. <laughs> yeah, everybody yeah. else is playing Monopoly. Yeah, yeah. Chris is over there like, well, uh, what about, hello, what? my baby. Hello, my baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a piece of shit. <laughs> what about uh, Ouija boards? We no. did that once. What? We, we did that one. Shit out so of annoying, bro. There's no demons and spirits that are moving the shit. It's you. I don't like your attitude. <laughs> I don't like your attitude. The fucking it's game. usually the person shit. that brought it up. Hey, let's play. Let's do Ouija. They're the one going like this. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> They're like, oh, there's spirits in this house. Like, this was built in fucking three years ago, this house. Why do you keep coming back to this fucking ghost? I don't know. Picture? I thought you guys wanted to talk about it. And then uh, uh, it, it's interesting. It, it, here's my thing about goats and Michael Jordan. Same thing. There you go. There we go. Wow. Wow. <laughs> and then Eric has the goat. Yeah, I'm the goat. Okay. Well, G O I T well, goat, greatest yeah. of all time. We actually do have that. It's a weird to bring a goat on stage, right? Like you, the, the the fans tell you who's the goat. Like, you can't decide. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Definitely post that on my Walmart. That is fantastic. <laughs> And just say a bunch of goats. Uh, first of all, fuck you, but that's fucking hilarious. That's funny. Goat. That's it. All right. Well, yeah, we did it, didn't Kevin we? Kevin Hart has leather pants on. Well, if there's anybody that's going to wear leather pants. By the way, those- but I wish bo- I could pull them off. Those panda dunks 
or th- those panda dunks. Dude, I can't even tell you how many fucking panda dunks were. When I was in London, I, uh, that's all I saw. The panda dunks? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We talking about Chappelle shoes? Uh, no, uh, uh, Chris Rock's. Just uh, white. No, no, not Chris Rocks. Rock's. Fucking uh, Kevin Hart. You're both racist. <laughs> and then Chris Rock How has on racist? white. Does Chris Rock have on? We're uh, racist against goats. White. Uh, it's like, Doc everybody Martins? there's black. What are you no, those about? are are those convert. What the fuck are those? Those are Doc studies? Martins. And then uh, Chappelle shoes have. A oh, oh no, I was talking about Chappelle. Sorry. Oh, you racist. Can you yeah, imagine yeah. being at this show? You're already excited that you're watching Chris Rock and Kevin Hart. And then Chappelle, Chappelle opens. comes and then out. No Chappelle, opens. no, Chappelle opened. It. Yeah, yeah, Chappelle comes out. It was a surprise. Wow. Like, you're just kind of like, damn. And then a goat. And then there's a goat. <laughs> With a The goat closed it. it. <laughs> man. Chris you know when, man. In his face right now. <laughs> Slap me now, bitch. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> you know when, man. And man. What's the deal with man? <laughs> <laughs> Standing ovation. What the be, the what goats would, doing transgender white, jokes. What would be the white <laughs> equivalent of this? It would be like Seinfeld and who? <laughs> it's already bad. Oh, Jim Gaffigan. <laughs> yeah, Louis like, C.K. Yeah. Oh yeah. Eh. Seinfeld, Louis C.K. No. It, what do you mean? Eh, it would be Louis. Because he's too, so controversial. Oh, I feel like well, he, so Dave Chappelle's not. So I, lo- Dave Chappelle. I love Louis. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. I got well, you. it sounds like you don't. <laughs> uh, <laughs> for for Burr, white guys, it'd be like Louis. Burr, it'd be Burr, Louis, David Tell. Ah. Uh, not David Tell though, because all these guys, David. No, dude, you're 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 George taking what I'm saying the wrong way. David Tell is phenomenal, mm-hmm. but you the, all these guys fill stadiums. You know what I mean? Oh, so it stadiums? would have to be like big, big acts. So well, Rogan, Bill Burr, yeah, Rogan Burr. But and, they do that when it's Chappelle, Rogan. Yeah, but I'm saying Rogan Burr and uh, they have to sell the same amount of tickets. Who was the other one? Jeff Ro- Dunham, Rogan Burr. <laughs> Who's the other one that we were talking Seinfeld. about? What a show! So, that no, no, would no, be. no, no. Can you imagine seeing Bill Burr? Daffigan? And we were just Jeff talking Dunham about no on the Burr road together. <laughs> they Louis. fly their helicopters. Burr, there. Louis, Rogan. Louis doesn't do uh, arenas. He, he, I think he, he could do Madison Square Garden for sure. Louis could. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he would sell it out. You didn't sell as many tickets like Rogan and Burr. No, no, no. Well, uh, well, that's what you said though, right? No, I didn't say that. <laughs> you know you fucked up, right? I said I have to do arenas. You know you fucked up, right? I did fuck up. Yeah, I'll admit when I fuck up. up. No, you fucked up, right? I didn't Does fuck anybody up. know what movie that's from? You know you fucked up. Right? No, what? Menace Society. <laughs> I like that one. Don't look over at me like I'm supposed to know. Yeah, yeah, black black guy. Guy. Yeah, look at your shirt. Yeah, look at your shirt. This is a real movie. Menace to Society was like the, the knockoff version. Oh, wow. Wow. Wow, yeah. wow, wow, wow. 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 It's a wow. knockoff wow. version. Uh, you're acting like wow. MC8 didn't have a fucking song on that yeah. soundtrack. You act like uh, Ice Cube's a real actor. Hold on a second, He is bro. a tremendous actor yeah. at this point. I do. You know in Three Kings when he's like, can you breathe? That was... <laughs> <laughs> That's good. when acting's easy, right? Can you breathe? <laughs> yeah, but he owns, you know, Ice Cube is a mogul now. Okay? Yeah, dude. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Remember when he... Oh, that yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. I wanna show us love up brought, in the club. Then he brought somebody out the that big guy. sounded just like him. Yeah, they're the and same still person. Still made a lot of money. Yeah. Mac ten. Yeah, Mac ten. West side boogie oogie oogie. Oh, in the backyard boogie oogie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Baltimore. See you next week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Dallas. Crystalia.com. Go get your tickets, dude. Thickboy.com. The, the it, tie-dye merch. Drops Wichita. Friday, baby. Oh, that's cool. Wichita, Wichita, fucking Wichita, dude. I'll be there, man. <laughs> Wichita's where the BTK killer got famous, dude. That's right. So come, let's change history and fucking have Chris D'Elia be the Wichita dude instead of BT killer because that's bad for you guys. Sure. It's bad It's bad press, man. And the Chicago one, not only August 26th. All right, love you guys. Eric will be in La Jolla. I'll be in La Jolla 9th, too. <laughs> 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 Sting, back up in this thing. I just got a call that said they want it at the wing. They got me working OT all night long. How many times I gotta make this song? Hey, hold on, what is this? Now y'all wanna switch? I'll just add a CB and Eric and they all adding Chris. How's that gonna fit? Wait, I get the gist. I just probably have to slow it down and hit it like this. It's the king, the wing, and the stink. Now, oh, it's the wing and the king and the stink. Now, hold on, hold on. Hold on, wait a minute, let me think. It's the king and the sting and the wing. Let's go, king and the sting and the wing. Brought it full circle and put on the whole team. Legendary trio, Brendan, Chris, and Theo. What you mean? You know it's the king and the sting and the wing.